A Saudi cleric has banned people from taking photographs with cats. Sure. Now, part of the reason why he has done this is because he was informed that this was an ongoing trend on the internet, and he was very much concerned that this would lead to the westernization of culture in Saudi Arabia. First, we have some pictures of Saudis with cats. Let's take a look. Oh, my God. To, to warn right. the kids here. These are the most non internet cat pictures <laughs> of all time. Oh, my God. They're this doing thing, it wrong. This thing must be so viral in Saudi Arabia. Yeah, Are those guys, those guys look cat? like they're seconds away from being westernized. <laughs> I think, yeah, that guy he might as well be uh, Bob Dylan. All right, I think that's just a random picture from the internet with a guy around cats. But anyway, there's a woman with cats. I chose Bob Dylan as my example of yeah, very American. A strange, I don't know, yeah. strange <laughs> yeah. choice. Anyway, uh, yes, uh, so, so, those did seem very sacrilegious, to be fair. So this cleric was told about a new trend of taking pictures with cats and has been spreading among people who want to be like Westerners. His response was, what? What do you mean pictures with cats? Taking pictures is prohibited. The cats don't matter here. He continued to say, taking pictures is prohibited if not for a necessity, not with cats, not with dogs, not with wolves, not with anything. Who's think, taking pictures with wolves? I don't think this guy understands uh, what happens with people and pets. You know? <laughs> <laughs> like cats and dogs are pets. Wolves, not really a pet. Yeah, <laughs> it's, he's got some pet issues. There's yeah. no question. Um, so I, I don't know anyone who's got wolves as pets other than the Starks. Right, and not anymore. <laughs> and uh, I like the I, he says uh, taking pictures is prohibited uh, if not for a necessity. Mm. When do you need? You, you absolutely need in to take a picture with a cat. In like, shake, wait, in wait, the shake has weighed in now. That one was an emergency. <laughs> that was you had that cat was too cute. You had to take that picture with the cat. Necessity. No, Insur insurance purposes. Yeah. <laughs> uh oh. Yes. <laughs> how insane is it, though, that like they're having discussions about how Saudis are not allowed to take pictures with cats. They're not allowed to play chess or checkers or all these like ridiculous. They're not allowed to have Pokemon because they're worried that it promotes Christianity and Judaism. But anyway. Yeah. Um, <laughs> At the same time, you have Saudi royalty coming to Beverly Hills, California, and throwing ridiculous parties where women are getting raped and molested. Yeah, but but that's that's okay. That's right. all right. There's right. no morality issue with that. Well, Taking pictures they, with cats, though. Yeah, did they pay any, take any pictures with pets while yeah. uh, doing those uh, wild orgies? If not, I think we're okay. We're in the clear. I mean, did anyone play chess? <laughs> there was no chess reported there. By the way, that's literal. Uh, they just uh, the Grand Mufti uh, said that the chess is forbidden. Because it encourages gambling, which makes me think that they're doing gambling wrong in Saudi Arabia. Look, if you're an elderly person who spends their time or spends his time worrying about what kinds of games young people play for fun, mm -hmm. and it's, there's no violence or no issue involved in it, then you have no life. Like, that's really pathetic. Mm. I mean, are there other things to worry about? Then I do, do kind of worry about that, though. Uh -huh. About people playing chess? No, other games. I'm like, oh, kids with these dumb games, and their video games, and their stupid you, songs. You know, Ben, you'd make a great grand mufti. <laughs> I'd make a good mufti. <laughs> he would. He'd enjoy banning things. That's I'm like 27% of the way toward being a mufti. Not even a grand mufti, just a regular mufti. <laughs> Do they have regular yeah. muftis? I don't know. <laughs> it sounds like an Italian sandwich. Uh, all right, and finally, I like that this guy's name is Sheikh Abdul Aziz El Sheikh. Yeah, but well, Yeah, so. dude, I got it. <laughs> You're a shake. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, no, no, one shake not good enough. We do two. Shake, Abdul Aziz Al Shake. I got it. And get the goddamn cats out of here. <laughs> but you wonder why people leave Islam. I mean, who's anti kittens? Like, what a like what a miserable interpretation. Of that religion. You know, you know what type of person is anti kitten? The type of person that thinks it's okay to stone a woman after she's been raped. That kind of person. Yes. Yeah, yeah way to take the fun out of the story, Anna. Yeah. Um, Keeping okay. it real. Yeah, Keeping no. it real. All we give Saudi down. Arabia a lot of leeway with some of their, you know, human rights abuses. Mm -hmm. And you so know, with that, other countries, we gotta invade because we gotta spread democracy. But Saudi Arabia, nah, it's all right. You guys can stone your women to death. We're a little hypocritical sometimes. <laughs>